Let's get down to it. We've been assigned to relieve two patrols, one at Caliban Jump Point and the other at Lennox Jump Point. The Caliban duty belongs to Alpha Flight, consisting of Avatar, 8-Ball, and Sandman, with Psychopath in lead. You will proceed to Nav-1 and relieve the patrol from the 346th Squadron. Lennox duty belongs to Charlie Wing, which Knox will be heading up with Dishwasher, Zorath, and Chance on his wing. Once we relieve the flights on duty, we will patrol the jump point until relieved by the next squadron. Any civilian cargo ships or freighters will be inspected for contraband. The brass believes Torgo is kitty free right now, and they want to keep it that way. Dismissed. You are cleared for launch, Lieutenant. Torgo Command, this is Frigate Ravens at Lennox Jump Point. A transport Julius jumped in a few minutes ago. The report's being pursued by one Corvette. Roger that. Take care of it. Confirmed. One Corvette in the system. We're engaging. Transport Julius. Retreat out of the combat zone immediately. Transport Julius, elite from your current vector. We are engaged in combat. Transport Julius, you are on a collision course with us! This is Frigate Alameda at the Elohim jump point. We have enemy task force entering the system. Send reinforcements. Over. All units, we have a kill route the incursion. Set condition red. Repeat, condition red. Sensors read two carrier battle groups. Oh great, not this again. And... Why does this stuff always freaking happen? Maybe they heard about the females we have here. God's own escort service is right. Alpha Wing, your situation has changed. I'll act as liaison between you and the top brass. Head to the rally point at Nav 1, where we're mustering our forces for a counterattack. Proceed to next waypoint. Isn't this a family reunion? Ugh. I don't usually have a hangover at family reunions. That green goop they shoot us up with sobers you up alright, but doesn't do anything for the headache. <laughs> oh, I would sympathize with you, Assassin, but then I couldn't laugh at you. <laughs> oh, man. You choose to drink, and you have to take what comes with Thanks, Ninja. You're a great friend. Remind me to slam you over the head with a frying pan when we get back to the Hermes. I can go for that. That way I can prove what I've always said about Ninja not having a brain. And that way we could also prove what I always said about Psychopath not having a soul. And about Assassin not having decent aim. And about the Hermes not having any frying pans. I'm gonna have looked all over the ship. There just aren't any there. You think I'm joking? I'm stone cold serious. Guys, could you cut it out? Remember, I've got a headache and you guys aren't helping at all. <laughs> yep, like I said, just like a family reunion. <laughs> All wings, stand by for assignment. Looks like we'll have to wait until this mission is over for the awkward talent show portion of the family reunion. That's too bad. I was thinking of doing my ventriloquist act. Let me guess. You play the part of the dummy. Oh, nice. A little obvious, but the timing was good. Ugh. As entertaining as this is, gentlemen, we've got a mission to fly here. 
Let's get back to it. Alpha, Bravo, and Delta Wings. You will be working together for this one. And I have updated your nav computers. Phalanx is in charge. A destroyer squadron has broken through several defenses and is approaching our last defense line in their path. If they break through, there's nothing to stop them from launching missiles at Sector HQ. You will skirt one of the minefields at NAV-2, then proceed to your destination at NAV-3. Good luck. I hope you didn't forget how to keep up with us while you played with those lead sleds, uh, man. Let's dust some furballs! Proceed to next waypoint. We got fighters hanging around in the asteroid field. <laughs> We're gonna have to get in there and flush them out. Everyone, be careful. Yes, mommy. and fortify the defenses. We don't want any more surprises coming through there. All right, all fighters form up and proceed to the next nav point. Proceed to next waypoint.
tree path is cut off, so she's fleeing to the Orsini jump point. Can you pursue, Colonel? Negative. We're low on missiles and high on damage. Alpha, Bravo, and Delta Wings, you will proceed to the Orsini jump point and immobilize the carrier. Don't let them leave this system. We're uploading the nav data to your computer. What about the unit at the Orsini jump point? We lost contact. Typical. Proceed to next waypoint. Carrier's burning hard for the jump point. Torgo Command, this is Bravo Flight. We've got incoming friendlies jumping in from Orsini. Carrier Centurion plus escorts. Roger that. We've been expecting them. Nice to see a friendly face, Hermes Fighters. We've been expecting the worst. We'll touch base later. Centurion, can you do something about that carrier? Already on it. Sorry, kitty, but do not pass go. Do not collect $200.
We were pulled off the front a month ago and sent deep into Confed territory for an escort job. We've been doing a high-speed run for the past two weeks. Just to escort some... convoy? Negative. It wasn't any damn convoy. So? Don't keep us in suspense. What have you been escorting? Well, it's not like you can ignore it when it comes through, so we might as well let you in on the secret. Yeah, tell us. You really can't say what it is. Might as well let you see it for yourself. It should be jumping in any time now. What in the name of God is this? Gentlemen, this is Confederation's Doomsday Weapon. Say hello to the biggest warship ever built by the Confederation. Say hello to the Behemoth. Hermes Fighter Unit, this is Torgo Command. What you have just seen is classified. You will forget that you've seen this. Torgo Command, seen what? Fair enough. Head back to base. Proceed to next waypoint. Mission complete. Welcome back, pilot. Anything interesting to report? Besides whacking a bunch of cats? Nah. Nice work, boys. We picked up a huge disturbance at the Orsini jump point. Torgo Command is pretty tight-lipped about the whole thing. Only that it was... expected? You sure you don't have anything else to report? What have we got to hide, Sweeney? I guess I've thrilled you enough. You have clearance to land.
Vulture, this is Mallard team. Sensor buoy is activated, jammer is calibrated, area is sanitized. Total sensor blackout in effect. Well done. Greg team is en route to relieve you. Return to home plane. Roger. Mallard team out. And with that, we have done the impossible. Hiding this big, giant thing. You expect this piece of garbage to win the war? Look at it, it doesn't even finish. It's Tolwyn. Enough said. That guy has always been a fan of dog and pony shows. Boss, what do you think? Does this thing have a chance? Hey, don't ask me, I just work here. Whatever happens, happens. Pilots, the fact that an ONI officer like me is holding this debrief instead of Major Delaney or Colonel Walker should give you some idea as to the secrecy that surrounds the Behemoth Project. What you've seen come through that jump point is classified and compartmentalized according to Conflict Security Article 61, Section 3B, and believe me, the punishments for violation are severe. You will forget what you have seen and you will make no reference of it in your after-action report. The Intel guys should be erasing your flight recorders as we speak. All of the Confederation is on a need-to-know basis with this initiative, and at this point, neither you nor anyone else on board needs to know. Now to things we can speak of. The Kilrathi suspected we were up to something in Torgo. This was the first time in a while they've launched a major assault against us, and after the losses they've taken, it's also the last time they'll be pulling something like this in the near future. You did a fine job taking out that destroyer group. You saved the lives of everyone in Sector HQ. And that was some fine teamwork you did with the Centurion in taking out that carrier. Admiral Tolwyn gives a bravo Zulu to all those who have fought today. Colonel Walker informs me that for your efforts today, all of you will have the rest of your leave off, with no duty. I know you will be, no doubt, indulging in some liberty, either here on the base or on the Hermes, but I will remind you again to keep your lips sealed. A lifetime in military prison is a steep price to pay to try to impress some good-looking ensign. Again, well done. Dismissed. Thank you.